All right, my friends, you just finished watching a video about Galileo. What we're going to do right now is we're going to go into our science workbooks because I want to show you a picture of what Galileo looked like, but I also want to share with you what his last name was. All right, so if you open up your science workbooks to page 153, you'll see this page right here, okay? And it's people and in science and engineering, okay? So Galileo was an astronomer, and that's someone who studies the sky and all the objects up in the sky. So he's a scientist, but he's also called an astronomer, okay? His name was Galileo Galilea, and you saw Galileo Galilei, I believe is how it's pronounced, okay? But we generally, you will hear him called Galileo by his first name, okay? So here's a picture of him. So obviously he was from a very, very long, long time ago. And he studied the sun, stars, and other objects up in the sky. And in the video you saw and you heard something else that he studied up in the sky, right? Okay, think about that from the video. All right, he used a telescope to observe them. Now, <coughs> In the beginning of the video, the children come upon the man who used to teach at their school. Did his telescope look like this telescope? No, his was a newer telescope. But this is the telescope that Galileo designed, and it enabled him to be able to see things up in the sky. Well, how do you think it helped him be able to see things up in the sky? What do you think it did so that he'd be able to see them? Because if we go outside in our backyard and look up into the sky, we can see maybe the stars and the moon, but can we see really close any of those things up in the sky? We can't. So that telescope it helps to make things look bigger so that more details are visible. And again, in the video, you learned something about something in the sky that he was able to look at and really see closely when the kids met Galileo, okay? All right, so Galileo was an astronomer who studied the sun, star, and other objects up in the sky. Remember back to the video. And he used a telescope to observe them. What I'm gonna ask you to do is turn the page, okay? And in this purple box right here, I want you to illustrate for me, thinking back to the video, what did Galileo see through his telescope that helped us learn about it, okay? So in this box, I want you to think back to the video, and if you need to go back and rewatch the video, what was something that Galileo was looking at and could really see because of that telescope, okay? And I want you to draw a picture of that right here for me, all right? And then down below, you're gonna see three pictures. I want you to circle the picture that Galileo used to observe the sky. Look at these three pictures and circle the one that shows what Galileo used to observe the sky, okay? And then you are going to show me what you learned from the video that Galileo looked at from his telescope. And you're gonna put that on Flipgrid for me, okay? All right, my friends, great job and Maybe someday you'll be an astronomer too and look through the telescope and discover things in the sky. That would be pretty cool. All right, friends, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.